that when we lose, we do lose together. When we win, we do win together. It's not just an individual. Yeah, an individual might make an error, um, didn't take the chance, the goalkeeper could have saved something. You know, so you can start pointing the finger at individuals. Now, that's one of the things that you don't really want to get to. You gotta, you gotta be accountable for your own uh, mistakes. You gotta assess yourself as an individual, but eventually, collectively, we gotta be as a team because at the end of the day, um, it is a team sport. It's not an individual sport. So, you you take you take the responsibility because each position have a responsibility to perform to their best. And obviously, if someone is not doing their job, then it does reflect not just you as from an individual standpoint, but certainly from a, a team perspective. Um, and yeah, uh, so one thing that you have to also identify in me saying that is that uh, when you lose, it's part of the game. It's something that you have to learn, you have to be able to, to bear with, uh, but also you have to take a lot of positive from the loss. Uh, when I say that, you hear everybody say, oh, I hate losing, we hate losing, and we all do. That's a, that's a given. It's what you learn from the mistakes to make sure that you don't make those mistakes again. That is a key element in it. And, and so uh, that's the first thing. And it's the same. Uh, it's probably on the, the same side. A little bit different when you're winning. Things are much easier. You're in a much happier place. Uh, things are going to plan. And it's about... The difference is about maintaining and being consistent in that approach. Um, so when you're winning, it's all about consistency. When you're losing, it's about changing the narrative into success and taking the, the positive from the defeat to make sure that when it comes around next time that we don't fall into the same mistakes that we have made that led us to losing that game. And so um, once you... Uh, once you're comfortable with the fact that, yeah, we have lost the game based when you reflect back based on the mistakes that we have made and we could have done things together, uh, what we could have done better to make sure you eradicate that those mistakes doesn't come back in. And so defeat are always the toughest uh, and the hardest to bounce back from. Uh, in, in all of that, when you do win, then it's a much happier and a joy, joyful place to be. So once you can define the difference uh, and then you ask yourself where I rather be as a team, we rather be on the winning team, right? And that's the most joyous. What we didn't do well, whether we didn't work hard enough as a unit, we didn't, we didn't defend successfully or, you know, there's various things that constantly keep popping up in defeat that to better you think. The hardest thing is to win football matches. The hard it's always been to be successful. No one likes anything easy. You never you probably hear that saying before. If it's easy, everybody would have done it. It's never easy, right? And and so uh, that's the thing that I've learned in my time and the journey. Now that I've gone into management, so those are the things I will take from the experience that I've gained over the years. But that's that's basically what that is in terms of. You know the uh, uh, to your you uh, to your questions. Those are the, the sort of um, things that I will sort of sort of um, point out in a more details than anything else.